can, can we? Not a bad-looking tinderbox you got there. You sound a bit green, horny gold. Is it envy? Because mine's bigger than yours. No, I reckon it's this Jamaican funk. I prefer the Spanish stuff. So, you've got yourself a fancy brig now. Fine. Well, I'm gonna teach you how to say the right. And how to take a prize the proper way. Thatch, we'll catch you up at the old fishing village. Aye. Your helmsman, Kenway. I take pride in piloting my own ships, Ben. Keeps me alert. There's a prize worth taking. Good. Take us in close. After you subdue a prize, project authority. Demand respect that you would never give yourself. This weaves a spell over soft minds. For your victims must always have in the back of their minds the uneasy idea that you could snap at any moment and unseen them from prick to stern. Fire what cannons you will. A man a few strikes if you must. But for God's sake, don't sink. It's no fun fishing cargo out of the sea. Although it can be done. Disabled now and taking on a decent amount of water. So keep your cannons quiet. Take care not to sink her. Oh, she's dead in the water. Steer up alongside her. Tengo un buen día, senor. I am Captain Hornigold, and this is my crew. We're sailors like yourselves, but quite unalike in our purpose. For we intend to take all that you owe. Yet no harm shall befall any man so long as he remains at ease. Is that clear? No me mate, senor. Tengo familia. Se lo suplico. Anyone speak English? English! L little bit. Tell your friends we're stealing your goods. And we won't hurt nobody if everyone stays as still as a sandbar. You got that? Please do repeat. Oh, for fuck's sake. Lock him in the hold! 
and take everything that isn't nailed down. feeling sailing about with this much stolen cargo. Get used to it. We'll need to take a few more prizes to make this a profitable day. Give me some speed! Who's the main? Pass him! Good take today, Kenway. Half a dozen scores of that size and you'll be set for a year. Now let's sell this cargo and fix up your jackdaw with a few more trinkets. Sod it, yeah. I'm looking for a prize that'll set me up for life. I'll be king of the West Indies then. We came to Nassau to get away from the likes of kings. Well, I'll be a man of property and promise anyway. Jesus, let that dream go, lad. Nassau is the place to be. Not in. Do you ever dream of the big score? A ship so full of gold and silver, you just split it and sail home. Sure, but it's only a dream. Every man hopes to find a dozen chests of gold with no owners. Oh, Ben, 
¿Quiere algo? take today. Keep this up and Nassau will be the first city where men and women may live as God made them. Easy and free. All it takes is a few drops of blood, sweat, and a swatch of cloth. We fly no colors out here. But praise the lack of them. So let the black flag signal nothing but your allegiance to man's natural freedoms. This one's yours. Fly it proud. I will. I hand over the docket I lent you. If we're to keep our Republic afloat, we'll need guns as well as gold. That means attacking the Navy. So long as they're flying King Philip's colors will not offend our own monarch. As you've likely seen, the number of merchants roving these waters is three score the number of military ships. Aye, easy purchase, but in small doses. Right. So to lure the Navy out of hiding, it's best to cause a bit of mischief.